Welcome to Big 12 Media Days. We are in Kansas City, and I am joined by TCU head basketball coach Trent Johnson. And coach, uh, young roster, only one senior. How does that benefit your team heading into the season that you have such youthfulness to your squad? A lot of unknowns. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> a lot of opportunities. Of Obviously, uh, we return Kavar Shepard. Mm -hmm. Chris Washburn, Brandon Parrish, Devontae Aaron, there's a nucleus of guys that have been through it for three and four years. So, but uh, the key for us is how the new additions, mm -hmm. how more fast they improve, how fast they get accustomed to the style of play. Kenrick Williams, your leading rebounder from a year ago, gone uh, due to injury. Who do you expect to step up in his absence, especially as far as grabbing those boards go? Well, it's going to be done by committee. Obviously, Brandon Parrish, who played the two for us last year, we moved to the three. And then Jalen Miller, who's a freshman from Seganville High School, you know, we're going to have to bring him along faster. Physically, he's talented enough to fulfill those roles. But let's not make any mistake about it. Kendrick will be missed mm -hmm. from a leadership standpoint, from a competitive standpoint. And he scored the ball for us well. So, But it's always, you know what, there's opportunities for everybody else. Of course. Uh, with all that being said, uh, I know you covered a lot of it, but you've now had a chance to go back and, and look at the tape from last season. Where do you hope your team improves the most heading into the 20? 2015-2016 season? Well, when we get in close games from the four-minute mark on, the ability to close those games, make good decisions with confidence, shoot the ball with confidence, make free throws with confidence, and obviously that's going to be the hardest mm -hmm. thing for us. It's the next step, you know, winning 18 games, but against the people that we need to beat to be successful, to be relevant, mm -hmm. you're going to have to play with a level of confidence and, and make plays. All right, looking forward to it. Coach Johnson, thanks so much for the time. And stay with us right here on Campus Insiders for all things Big 12. We'll see you later.